I'm back. Um, hold on, the camera is acting. I gotta get into a room that has. There we go. Better lighting. Um, what am I dropping back off? If I if I go turn that into Strauss, when will I complete the quest? But will, they, will I still be able to do the other two, um, right, let's go. two people? Right, but... Okay. Yeah. That's my only concern. Because I like to do, uh... Because if it would have canceled those two missions, then we would have gone and done the other two guys. But we're going that way anyways to Emerald City, so... Um, whilst we're there... Okay. I also want to get... This isn't going to be the end of the chapter, is it? I want to do the, um... Bounties before we move on. Okay. I'm gonna go do bounties before uh, we hit the next chapter. Can't see me. It's daylight. Usually, I'm coming up in there in the nighttime, but. Good morning, Uncle Arthur. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do. Yeah, we're gonna be doing a full. Uh, map reveal. Yeah, we're gonna go everywhere before the next chapter. Oh, I got four dollars and ten cents. Yep, there's the ledger. Yeah, I think I've I've donated the most money. We don't want to. Okay. How's it going? This one. Oh yeah, we're getting the leather working tools. Yeah. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, nice. Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, 
It's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Dave Thomas Downs. Where's... Where's that one? Oh. Uh, oh, that's the mission I just got. This one. Okay. Alright, let's go do lodging twice. Okay. Nice. <clears throat> very nice, very nice. Alright, so when we want to go here. Yeah. Uh, we know we have to do medical tent twice. Good morning. Uh that's this one. Still breathing, so must be good. Excellent. So let's, I mean, 30 bucks. <clears throat> we can do 30 bucks. Let's do it there. Um, let's go craft some satchels. There you are, Dutch. Hello, Molly. Which was over here. This can't do with a few improvements. Why don't you take a look at my ideas? Okay. I thought we had. Oh, we gotta go get this stuff. Hey, I thought we had all this, some of this stuff. Are you okay? <laughs> I know we did a perfect deer pelt. Just remember, my items are one of a kind, Mr. Morgan. You'll need to bring me the right materials first, Mr. Morgan. Uh, we donated 50 bucks to the tithing. Alright, let's get provision. Provision twice. And we have to donate 50 bucks. Some good material. Good morning, Arthur. Oh, and we've been donating, um... Gotcha. Tribute. Good morning, Arthur. Give money. And then we're going to do... Provisions twice.
Let's see, what else can we get? That we want. Should we just get everything because we can? Do we need to save? Should we be saving some of this money for something? Yeah, that's that's what I was gonna do is uh, two for the uh, get the ammo up and everyone. They probably do the tents for everybody. Let's finish off all of the all the basic tents. Yeah, most of the ones that I want is this one. This is going to be the ammo one. to finish off for the chicken coop in the stables, but that's it. Okay. Didn't... Okay, so now we need to donate. I can't believe I didn't have, I don't have any. Why is there a guy tied up over here? Not gonna worry about it. Um, I know we, we've gotten pelts. I don't know why it's saying we don't have any pelts donated. I don't have any pelts on me. Okay, so what do we need? Oh, Mr. Morgan! I've jotted down a few things that I think could be uh, nice additions around here. Um, all right, so we need to uh, donate five carcasses. Which, how much have we? We've done a. Okay, so we have one there. Okay, so we need to go hunting. I thought we had a perfect deer one. Thought this would cheer me up. Alright, well we know there's Thanks, Pierce. You know what? That's just sad. Yeah, they only sh they only said what? Okay. 
I'm guessing the Springfield is the best rifle in the game. Okay, boy. Is this one? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, that's true. That is... Uh, 100% true. Plus, while we're there, we can go do the two yeah. debtors. How many chapters are there? Interested in some friendly competition? No. That's luck. Oh, so there's six... There was something here. Yeah, I was hoping to shoot it. Fast travel to there? I thought we could fast travel now. We could fast travel though. Can we not fast travel? Gotcha. Short. 
Yeah, because there's some deer right outside the house, right outside the camp. Yeah. Oh, okay, I get you. Slow up now. Oh. Hey, boy. That's an interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work in the right way. Well, they all say that. I never yeah. met an idiot that called himself one. Very true. In that case, I'm an idiot. But I know how to get things done efficiently. Arthur, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not... Idiots, let us prove it to you. Okay, I'll tell you what. Arthur! Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin <clears throat> by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. <clears throat> and yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. By marriage. I love how they have to distinguish by marriage. Come here, buddy. Yeah. Oh, really? Really? Really. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? You know, he's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Clearly, you've recovered from your bear encounter. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but oh, we'll, you we'll don't worry. We'll... Come on, Jose. We're gonna search joke. it thoroughly. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches. That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. I love that. I love how they always put... You're scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. How he used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. That what you call finding out a little? Once he opens up, hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on.
There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, and I'm not allowed to hurt him. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. right there I reckon we can do it now I'll head over distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house find what you can then get the stagecoach or wait until nightfall sneak in then I'll get the coach you can try the house what do you think let's do it now sure all right then don't follow me. <laughs> Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. <laughs> <laughs> 